It's February 1st, and this is the day, that day I've been waiting for to see Anchor Watt when it's not overly crowded with tourists and it should be beautiful. However, it is actually a pretty busy day because today is Chinese New Year's day and there are a lot of local Khmer tourists from around the country celebrating the new year and many people in the park here with their families enjoying the day but it's still very very not crowded and it's something I've wanted to do for a couple of years now and here we are so we're about to enter Anchor Wat and we'll see what it looks like Five meter. So this was built by our great Khmer king called Surya Varman II at the beginning of the 12th century. Between the year and Buddha, even only a few Buddha left, but they call it Gallery of Thousand Buddha because it used to have thousands of Buddha in the 16th century. All right. So um, what are the famous thing about Angkor Wat? Is the size, 195 hectare and it's known as the largest village. Oh, okay. The first register you can see... Um, so, uh, one more head. Original of here, you have five places. Two head and five places. Two head. Yeah, uh, one in the bottom is four by six, and one on top is one by It was cleaned up many times, but because of the roof was leaking, um, this always turned the carving into black, into mossy, and, and a lot of lichen. But um, recently. Yeah, and this relief I think is quite popular for people to show in videos and talk about religious belief about heaven and hell. Both in Buddhism and Hinduism, after death, they believe they would go through the trap door and get tortured by the god of death or his assistant. Here you could learn some of the different tortures in hell. And then driving the nail in. You see, this one you could see clearer, you could see that the hammer and the nail that is driving the nail through the body mm. or hitting with measurement. Uh -huh. <laughs> and the group of the sinner were written in the ancient script. through their mouth to break the teeth and then they get the pins pin the tongues out and split into two then one piece of tongue up here and another piece pulling out the tongue
and then put like dry wooden pack through the hole that they make and then hit it with hammer and then pour the water and then the wood is wrap on it that's what we were told during our training session okay so they spin it but it's chiseled uh chisel is to cut it or to polish it or to shape it but then to get all of those equally like for example imagine of you So this is what I was talking about that many of the people ask the question. If it is solid. Oh if it is hollow inside. Right. A room or something. But in 1933 friends they excavate central shrine 25 meter depth. Yes, yes, this is like yeah, that's a much better example. Although this is not a flat surface, it's carved. It's carved. But you can see here, oh, the sun, the cloud came. A cloud just... Even clearer in your phone. I think if you don't let this... Um... Yeah, no, I'm going to go in and I'm going to go like this. Yes, it is. Wow, I never, I, I just take one, just one of the. This is so like when you're taking the picture from the, the right exact entrance wow it's amazing never thought of that uh, maybe you don't come here in the late afternoon <laughs> I no never... i've been here i've been here thousands of times but i just never thought of this yeah this is exactly when you look from the angle of the pond for purifying and this is when you look from the the carving it's like the tower with the carving yeah Amazing. Wow. And some of the corner you only can see four towers. See look at it. Like when you go to the corner of Uncle Wat and take the picture of the reflection. Right. <laughs> oh my god i am gonna have so much fun editing this video oops still rolling